says here, write the chemical equation when sulfuric acid reacts with sodium hydrogen carbonate. So we have um, sulfuric acid and we have sodium hydrogen carbonate. I think they meant to write sodium bicarbonate, but that's okay. So sulfuric acid here. So what, what we're doing, is we're going to first write the chemical equation, right? So we have sulfuric acid, which we know here is an acid. So we know that we have some type of H. And it's if you dissect sulfuric acid, if you remove this uh, ic acid here and you add H back, you're going to get the sulfate here, which is SO4, 2 minus. If you do the little crisscross with the 1 plus and the 2 minus, you're going to get H2SO4 as your chemical formula for hydro for sulfuric acid. And then sodium bicarbonate, I assume that's what they're writing here. If you break that down to ions, we have Na+. Plus. And then I guess you have the H here in this case here. So NaH with the hydrogen here. And then carbonate simply just CO3. So this is NaHCO3. So now you have both of our guys here. So we have our, we can write our balanced chemical reaction, right? We have H2SO4 plus NaHCO3. It's going to react to form. Well, what is it forming, right? So this simply is a double displacement reaction here. So if Na here is going to go with this sulfate here. So we have Na2SO4. So this is sodium sulfate. Plus I have H goes in going with the H, uh, CO3 minus here, which is going to make carbonic acid. So H2CO3. And in reality, actually, H2CO3 breaks down into uh, water and carbo uh, carbo uh, carbon dioxide. So if you wanted to, you could actually rewrite this as also uh, Na2SO4. Plus, we have uh, C carbon dioxide, so CO2 plus H2O. And what we can do is we can balance this chemical reaction, right? So uh, I believe only a 2 is required here. Uh, because we have two sodiums on the side, we have two sodiums on the side, so I write a two here. I have um, one sulfate, one sulfate, which is good. Um, I have here two plus four here, so this has to be a two as well. And this is in here is our balanced chemical reaction for this problem. We have two HCl, two Na two plus. It's good. 2CO2 and 2H2. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Let me uh, let me rewrite this actually, because I because I wanted to rewrite this as these guys here. CO2 and H2O. But I don't know if you're you, you're really going to need to know that, just because um, just because you don't know if carbonic acid actually breaks this down. So let me rebalance this. So we have two Na plus two Na and two Na's here. We have two CO3s. Um, and then we have uh, H2 here. So we're going to have two H's and then we're going to have two carbons here, which means I'm going to have to put a two here as well. And then I'm going to also have, f so this makes actually four hydrogens here. So I'm going to have to put a two here because I have two plus two, uh, one times two here, which is two. So I'm going to have to add a two here as well. So this here is a balanced chemical reaction. We have sulfuric acid plus two sodium bicarbonate, which is a sodium sulfate. Uh, sodium sulfate plus two CO2 plus two H2O. So this is the correct. So this solution here is correct because they gave us the balanced chemical equation here.